the Weatherby's Lonsdale Cup is a Group 2 two mile event which will close day two. I've got a pretty small field for this one. It's El Paso Jewel and Anaheim Prino for Vinnie Gerard at the top. Go forth, my son, for Joshua Sutherland, Lady Macbeth for Leon Van Rensburg, and Modern Bell for Craig Bickwith. So just a field of five then over two miles to end the day. And away they go. And go forth, my son, at the black and the red hoops. Just about the first issue it was the field of five past the totalisator board on the big screen and past the winning post now and then swing out left handed for a complete circuit of this track. And go forth, my son is in the lead, leading by a couple. To Modern Bell in second, and Lady Macbeth is third, Anaheim Primo is fourth. Two greys at the back for Vinnie Gerard. Double handed in this one. Go forth, my son is in the lead by about a length and a half. Modern Bell second. Lady Macbeth on the inside third, and the Gerard Greys El Paso Jewel and Anaheim Primo. Technically the back pair, but they're no more than two lengths off the lead. The lead which is currently held by Go Forth, my son. Line of four. How long can I have? It's going to be up into a virtual line of five before long, I think. Where are they going? No Derek Hinton horse in this one to kick on into a lead. We can get some pretty good close up shots of them. All racing in the right silks as well, which is nice. And go forth, my son is in the lead. From El Paso, Jewel and Anaheim Primo. Modern Bell between those two. And Lady Macbeth now just the back marker as the leader. Just quickens the pace a little bit. El Paso, Jewel in second. Modern Bell third, Anaheim Primo fourth. And Lady Macbeth just at the back in fifth. towards the final six furlongs then and go forth my son continues to show the way and this modern bell now pokes his head into second with El Paso Jewel closest to us and Lady Macbeth now making a forward move as well coming up alongside modern bell they're within half a length of the leader now and go forth my son is joined by lady macbeth and on the outside is modern bell and el paso jewel tucked in behind anaheim primo he wouldn't rule anything out yet they're all still in with a chance with three and a half furlongs to go and lady macbeth just about goes to poke ahead in front but every time she does so go forth my son just pushes out again with el paso jewel closest to us but now lady macbeth seems to have won that little battle for the time being and is in the lead but immediately pressed by El Paso Jewel on the outside. Go forth my son, he's still battling on the inside then Modern Bell and I'm Primo being switched to the outside. That one's got a bit of work to do, there's a furlong to go and it's Lady Macbeth in the lead from El Paso Jewel in second. They're being chased by Modern Bell and go forth my son and home Primo is next to inside the final half furlong and Lady Macbeth on the inside is still just in the lead. El Paso Jewel is trying to close it, it's close on the line. That's another one that's going down to the judge. And the angle probably favours the far side, so you'd probably guess that Leon's horse has held on. Probably won it by a head. To be fair. Let's take a look. Uh, Lady Macbeth for Leon Van Rensburg, the winner. El Paso Jewel for Vinnie Gerard was second. Modern Bell for Craig Beck with third. Go forth, my son, Joshua Sutherland fourth. And Anaheim Primo for Vinnie Gerard was fifth. Mm -hmm.